Welcome to a ViewSonic unboxing. My name is Ray and today I have for you the VX2728J2K. This is our newest in our VX28 Omni lineup, which represents our new higher end of the Omni. Uh, these feature ergonomics, these feature IPS displays, uh, and these features uh, kind of more of a premium feel uh, for our mainstream Omni lineup, which is all about uh, the best value in gaming. So let's get this thing open and show you what you get in the box. Once we get into the box, you're gonna get some items here to help you assemble the monitor. So the stand comes in two pieces. This is the kind of the upright portion of the stand. This will what holds your monitor up. We'll set that to the side for a second. We have some documentation and the screws needed to mount the stand, so please hold on to that. And then we have the foot for the stand. This foot will sit on your desk and hold up the monitor. It sits just like that. We have our power adapter for the monitor. We have a display port cable to connect the monitor. And we have our power cable that goes uh, straight to that power adapter, powers the whole monitor off. Now that we've kind of got our box all disassembled here, we can start to assemble the monitor and it's just a couple easy steps. So first we're gonna take the upright portion of our stand and the bottom of our stand, they will sort of join together. And then there is a thumb screw on the bottom with a little handle that you can turn until it's nice and finger tight. Okay, so now our stand is fully assembled here. We're gonna tear the back, uh, covering the sort of uh, foam pack uh, covering, the sleeve that goes over the top of the monitor so that we can expose the four VESA holes on the back, which is where this monitor will mount to. If, for example, you don't want to put this stand on, but you want to put it on a monitor mount, these are the four holes that you would use. So these are 100 millimeter apart VESA mount holes, so those can go right on a stand. Okay, so now we're going to take our stand. We're going to line it up with the four holes on the back of the monitor. You just kind of hold it there and then we're going to put in our screws to get everything in place. Okay, now that our four screws are nice and tight, we can pull the monitor out of the foam packaging. Now let's talk about the monitor itself and let's talk about its panel. This one has a 2K resolution, so that's 2560 by 1440. We also have a version of this in uh, 1080p full HD, um, but this 2K one is, is nice because it's got that higher resolution. Still has 165 hertz refresh rate, um, which is doable on the display port, and then it's got dual HDMIs, and those go up to 144 hertz refresh rate. Uh, in terms of feature set, uh, this does support HDR10. So if you've got you know nice HDR gaming you want to do on here, this does support it. It's not going to be as high as something like our high-end elites with their mini LED that can do uh, VESA 1600 HDR, but it does give you an idea of what uh, kind of HDR quality can give you. So we think it's a nice touch. Uh, in addition, because we wanted to have that smooth, buttery gameplay, uh, we give you AMD FreeSync Premium in this panel. So it did pass all certification tests. It does work with AMD FreeSync. Uh, and those of you who have uh, NVIDIA cards, you can enable uh, G-Sync as well on it. Um, it's not a G-Sync uh, compatible monitor, but it does support G-Sync. Um, Next up, we've got the ports. As I said before, it's got two HDMIs and a display port. So with three digital ports, you can have two consoles connected to it and a PC or two PCs. Maybe you have a work computer and a gaming computer, and then you've got your game console. All of those can be connected to this. Very easy to switch between uh, inputs and uh, have them all work together harmoniously. Also, one of the things about this model that's uh, really nice, and it's actually the J in the part number, uh, has to do with this adjustable stand. So it's got a full ergonomic stand. It allows you to adjust it for height up and down pretty far. Uh, it also swivels 30 degrees. You can swivel it a little bit there. And then it's got a pivot. So it can pivot 90 degrees. 
Uh, if you want to do anything in a portrait mode, maybe you're working on a portrait uh, piece of art and you want to have your, your Photoshop in portrait mode, it can be really useful for that. If you're a programmer and you want to see a lot of code, uh, and you know, you're only going to be maybe 80 characters wide anyway, but you're going to be really long in code. It's really great to use it in portrait mode as well as those who uh, have like a Discord chat and you want to see the chat history, see a lot more of it when it's in portrait mode. Um, so we think this is great for uh, any gamers that've got you know, streamer setups or multi-monitor setups. This is particularly good for that. Put that back to landscape. So this has just been a quick unboxing and overview of the VX2728J2K. Please watch this space for more exciting videos from ViewSonic.